so in last lesson we learn how to print the ascertained text now with the same concept that include text we learn how to print the cell order header text so for that first go to vs02 and open any cell order transition code for cell order is vs02 currently i am showing the concept of cell order header same way you can print the line item text of any object okay so first see for include text we required what we required the text name object text id and language so language we are passing from through the code first three we required so how to get the first three for the cell order header text for that go to text id here one text i have already added here let me add second also this is header note from so now how to know the three parameter which we required go to here just put a cursor here and here go to header okay not here just double click first here double click in this text area and here go to header first double click in the text area so here we can see the text name so what is text name cell order number language is fine text id is 0001 and object is vbbk so here what we required text id that is 0001 the object is vbbk and name we have to pass the cell order number this is for the first header node for the second one remaining all will same only the id will change double click here go to header see here text name order order number language and text id is 0002 earlier it was 0001 same object vbbk like this first we have to identify the text object text id and the name and for the line item it is different the name will be different for line item if you check it will be a combination of cell order and line item see till here it is cell order number and remaining is a line item okay first object vbbk here vbbp vbbp fine so in case if you want to pass line item you have to concatenate order number and the line item as of now i'm focusing only to print the header okay so here what i will do i will create one more text node here go to change mode right click create text okay here change this from text model to include text press enter and now text name what we have to pass in the text name cell order number right so i will says just drag and drop the order number here okay what is the object text object is vbbk vbbk okay and the id was 0001 right so 0001 and in the language i will pass the global data field gv underscore language drag and drop here fine and the name i will change here like so header text okay so header text So those four are important: text name, text object, text ID, and language. And select this checkbox. No error if text does not exist. Save this. First, activate. And now go to layout.
now go to data view and here drag and drop this so header text here what i will do i will go to layout and this i will bring at the top hmm? so so header text and i will increase the box size i already explained the different ways like we can select the width fix height fix etc okay expand to fit with the width and height fine so i am selecting this way just save we can also see the print preview here default box close this activate the form effect order number 1006 effect breakpoint i will remove after this session now we don't require a breakpoint see the output here see header text from the sales order header the same text was there in the header area cross check the values so same text we can see here okay so like this we can print the sales order header text also item text based on our requirement we should know how to pass the value of this text name text object and text id i explained you how to identify object and text ids fine so in this way we done with the session on printing of sales order header text that is sales order long text in the adobe form thank you